When we were together, the moments I cherished with every beat of my heart. Oh my goodness, goosebumps. Nancy Parker's husband sang a touching Lionel Richie tribute to his wife today as mourners wipe tears from their eyes. Mm. Good evening, everyone. I'm Katie Moore. And I'm Cherise Gibson in for Karen Swenson. You saw it there. A lot of family, friends, and hundreds of people from the New Orleans community paused today to just say goodbye to such a wonderful woman, TV news anchor Nancy Parker. Yeah, three hours of moving tributes at Xavier University this morning. Emotional songs from famous musicians, and as you heard there, even from her husband, Glenn Boyd. Meg Ferris brings us some of the service. The love from our city was overwhelming. People Nancy never met. I felt like she was a part of my family. And what she represent, you know, as a beautiful woman, a mother. And people she just met once, like this she man who rescued Nancy when she was her, covering the big oil spill yeah. and her boat was taking on water. And uh, we became friends ever since. And I, I keep this picture hanging on my uh, refrigerator. This is the guy that saved my life. This is the guy that saved my life. And wish I could have been there for this time. Or this man who met Nancy in this jacket at a fundraiser. And Nancy said, Dave, wow, I love that jacket. <laughs> so I wore it today in respect for, for her and her kindness. Inside, the spirit moved everyone with song from the soul queen of New Orleans. How great thou art. Then sings my soul, my Savior God, to thee. And one of her Delta Sigma Theta sorority sisters reminded all of us to live like Nancy because life is short. Nancy, you ought to wear a smile more and to remember that this little dash might only last a little while. So smile. So when your day comes. <laughs> but no one moved those celebrating Nancy's life more than her husband, Glenn Boyd, who serenaded her with a love song. I love only you. Meg Farris, Eyewitness News. <laughs> After that memorial service at Xavier, there was a procession with a traditional brass band, dirge, marking, marching to just a closer walk with thee, followed by a hearse and then a horse-drawn hearse. And as the procession reached Fox 8 Studios, the music turned more upbeat and the tone did as well, celebrating Nancy Parker's life and upbeat spirit. That horse-drawn hearse with the police escort led the way where there was a bell ringing ceremony in front of Fox 8. And family and friends also released doves at the end of that celebration in honor of this amazing woman.